Hi everyone, it's Kelly here. Um, just want to go over really quickly something I discovered completely by accident about the uh, sticky tape on our rulers. We've had lots of comments on how awesome it is and how easy it is to apply and remove without any sticky residue. Um, the one thing that I did discover on the weekend though is that if you have a sew slip mat underneath your um, your piece of fabric or your quilt that you're quilting, if the sticky tape, because it is quite abra abrasive, if it does come in contact with that mat, it will scratch it. So please be very, very careful and be very aware of that. While the sticky tape, of course, if you've got it on here, helps you move everything as one unit. But on the weekend, I was working on a small project. And consequently, um, you can see what the part that wasn't touching my quilt the part that was sticking over actually did to my mat. Um, needless to say, I wasn't too happy about that. But just so you know, and if, if you do find that you are going to be hanging out further than where you are, because naturally you're going to put pressure on and it's going to create some um, pressure there as well on, that, on the sticky tape. So if you do um, see that you're doing that, either put a piece of masking tape over top of the sticky tape if you don't want to take the sticky tape off or just take it off altogether is probably the best way to do it. Um, you can see I've got sticky tape here on Turkey. Uh, yeah, so that's just a little bit of a public service announcement, I guess. Okay, thanks. Have a great day, everyone.